ranked choice voting is question two on the 2020 Massachusetts ballot. Right now when you vote, you just check off one box only choosing one candidate. Ranked choice voting would allow you to choose your favorite to your least favorite. I tried to explain it to my father and he looked at me and it was like giving me a smirk. He's like, what are you talking about? WMCT spoke with Dr. Joseph Cleo, a political science professor at Framingham State. He explains how this new way of voting would work in the Bay State for non-presidential elections. Let's say hypothetically there are four candidates running for one seat. You will then get to rank in order, you know, candidate A, I want him or her to be first place, candidate B will be in second place, and candidate C third place, and so on. Versus the current method of voting. Candidate can win that seat with like 40% of the vote. And that means that 60% of the votes are literally wasted. And so it forces the candidate to win at least a majoritarian outcome, 50% plus one. Cambridge is the only Massachusetts town that has ranked choice voting. But just up north, this process is in full swing. Maine has implemented a ranked choice voting system for what Massachusetts is proposing. Ranked choice voting could stop the stigma of third parties. Eliminates the so-called spoiler effect. The biggest argument against ranked choice voting is the change and the possibility of it bringing confusion to voters. More resources and time will be needed. Governor Charlie Baker shares similar concerns. From our point of view, this thing is just too complicated to add on top of that. The counting process alone um, could get unbelievably difficult. Dr. Cleo says ranked choice voting could change the way candidates run their campaign. Encourages more positive campaigns and less negative advertisement because now as a Democrat and a Republican, I now um, have to court voters beyond my supporting base. If you vote yes on question two, ranked choice voting would be in effect in 2022. And a no vote will keep voting the same by only selecting one candidate. Stacey Serkisun, WMCT News.